Hi Dragons, my name's Helen and this is my husband Mark and we're here today to ask for £60,000 in exchange for 20% of our business. Belly Bambino is a multi-award winning brand of seagrass belly baskets designed for kids. I'm sure you'd all agree that kids can be a little bit messy and untidy and as a stay-at-home mum of three young children drowning in the never-ending chaos of their toys, I wanted to create practical but fun toy storage. Our belly baskets are handmade from seagrass, making them a natural and sustainable choice for families. The designs and textures of our baskets also add a sensory experience for the children. So imagine when we started, when she said to me, do you think I could sell a few baskets to make a few extra pounds? Roll forward just a few months and our kitchen was filled with baskets as we frantically painted them because she sold almost £6,000 worth. The majority of sales to date have been direct to customer, but we're now stocked by major retailers, including George or Mum and Baby, Kidley, which is part of ASOS, and Scandiborn. The only limiting factor to the growth of Belly Bambino is in-house production, so we've been working hard to outsource production, which is almost complete. Where do you get these? You said you make them. So we, we get the actual base basket imported from Vietnam yep. and then we add all the designs um, ourselves in-house. Yeah, so this is the bit that you put on to yep. a bit of colour. Yeah, and yeah, so embroidery, a little okay. bit of dyes. Helen, what's your background professionally? Um, so um, I've do, been doing Belly Bambino for the last three years. Then I was a stay-at-home mum for seven years. And you were designing these pieces? Yeah, yeah. How did, how did you learn how to do that? So <laughs> the idea came up is when I was feeding my daughter and I had a basket in her nursery, just a plain one. And because I was tired, like the um, light was cast across the basket and it looked like ears. And I was just like, that would make a really cute dog or a cute cat. <laughs> so I just tried doing it just to have in her nursery. And then suddenly I was like, oh, maybe I can sell these. What do you think? I was like, yeah, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's really funny that you thought she was a basket case. <laughs> oh, I did. I was like, yeah, so was, could I make someone? I was like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, I know. And then we were. He was painting tigers until your midnight. Tired, your tired hallucination yeah, turned into, exactly, a, into yeah. a really <laughs> yeah. cool business. I think it's amazing. It's beautiful. Oh, thank Absolutely you. beautiful. What's the plans over the next 12 months? What, what is it that's going to make this business get to four, five, six hundred thousand in turnover? It's the scale up. The, the limiting factor has been internal production. So the maximum number of baskets we can make in a month is around 500. So we've been working for about a year to find outsourced production. Hello, Mark. So the baskets cost how much? Uh, the, the large baskets are about three pound fifty, including tax demanded. Yeah, here. And what does it cost you to add on the extra process. The most expensive to make is the yellow lion. Yeah. Uh, that's 17 pounds and to make. Yeah, 17 pounds 15 pence but including the but surely, including. surely. If you want this to be commercial, surely the idea is to get your Vietnamese factory to finish them locally. Yes. And that would be it. We have. We've got that's what we've got now. We've got a Thai a Thai factory that's going to produce the complete and finished oh, you basket. Have. And, yeah. and, and what saving have you made? Uh, it's down to 11 pound dropped in the UK. Right, so that, that, that so you, you're in the right direction. Yes. Um, you mentioned you sold some to Jojo. Yes. Uh, Mama Baby. And how many did you sell? I think it's about 300 so far. I think you've come up with something, but you're not quite there. And in a way, I'm sitting on the fence thinking, it can only get so big the way you are now. That's why we really love a dragon to be able to help yeah, but us it, take you us know, there. You know, the funny thing is, you might do two, three, four hundred grand, but if you want to do millions, like I would want, I think yeah, it needs a lot. Doesn't look refined enough. Doesn't look coordinated enough. It needs to be finished a lot better. Together, we could make it amazing. With your input, what we've done so far, with our enthusiasm, and I just, I don't know, I just think we can grow it. And I think, I think we make a great team. He's a king in the baby business. I, I know. know, that's what, you were the one, you were the one that we... And king of the jungle meets king of the baby business. Yep. We can do it. I'll tell you what I'll do. Ooh. I'm going to give you all of the money, but I want 40%. Done. <laughs> <laughs> 
What? Hang so on. we're supposed to talk to the wall? Hang on. Supposed to talk to the wall? No, he's busy. Can I just <laughs> hold you one to second? To Helen, to the be most fair. important thing Sorry. is that this this is not your business, and Sorry, you just made a like decision. It. Yes, it isn't. So Helen, you need to decide. I know. Shall we talk to the wall? Shall we talk to the wall? Talk to each other. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I would love to accept your offer. Great! Yay! Looking forward to working with you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you, you very much. Thank well you. done.